Here it is. It's 1978 International Lodestar 1700. Uh, formerly a logging truck. Now we're going to make it into uh, just a cruising, prey, semi-ratted out truck. that I'm especially psyched out of my mind about. You know, it's one of those ideas where you're just like, yes! <laughs> <laughs> As you can see, I've uh, got the radiator out, I got the intercooler out, I just need to get this uh, condenser off. And I didn't have the right tools to get these fittings apart, so I brought them from a friend of mine that has a shop, and that would be Jack's Garage in Angleton. He loaned me these parts. So if you need any everyday work in your car or something like that, Jack's Garage in Angleton. He can take care of you. Now, I forgot which one of these fits in. All right, let me show y'all what I got. Last night I got everything cleaned up out of here. Front's ready to go, especially on this side. Not much left there. On this side I've got, uh, I need to take those, uh, the back hoses off the back of the uh, AC compressor, because I'm saving that, and get the exhaust disconnected. And the heater hoses. Here, hoses are still left on there too, so I gotta pop those loose, which ain't nothing. But what I want to do is come in here and get started on pulling this dash and get all the, uh, the rest of the wiring harness pulled through. So let me go grab a stand for this. So to save us my heartache, yesterday I pulled. I think, how many screws was it? I pulled a dozen sheet metal screws out of this dash skin right here. So I pre-loosened everything up. So we're gonna see if it'll just, what, if it'll come out or not. I did find the actual original owner's manual too. There was some more surprises in here. Oh, it's got some sketchy wiring behind it. What in the world is this? Some kind of glue filler. Yeah. What's this? Got some on this. Oh yeah. It's it's that crusty. So it looks like the original dash was actually brown. That was it. I'm gonna get a trash can. Come over and disconnect those switches on that side. And you can literally, it's, I'm just, just, I grab it, it falls apart.
gross. Oh, it's... <laughs> it's bad. It's terrible. <laughs> the, so you see the... So this is... Oh, uh, this might be original, but it was glued in. But you can see the, the brown stuff. This is not bad. Most of it's in the trash in that trash bucket over there already. This is a, one of those skins you can buy. To oh yeah. Replace gotcha. it. And uh, it's just nasty. It almost looks like a like somebody glued a trash bag to it. It's just nasty. It's going in the back. Mercy. Nailed it. I'm trying to save these gauges because I'd like to use them because it'd be a direct connect to the wiring harness. Right. But we'll see. Special. Just, you know, it's got a little, I ain't gonna say sentimental, but it, it just would be easier. <laughs> less, less expensive. How about that? Yeah. I would tell you, there's some. Woo. Look at this, here's your piece. You the smell hit me when I came through it around the corner. I mean, you can just. Oh, wow, yeah. Yep, cut myself. Told myself I wasn't going to do that. Kill me not. Huh? Kill me not. <laughs> All right. These are tetanus shots recent. Wires on the back of that. Here they are, too. No wires. It's just the uh, the connection is plugged right into it. So we're gonna save this for the load store. And hopefully use it. Wow. Bring up the screw situation. I'm gonna put them in my pocket because they're too damn sharp. It's about to the point where I'm just gonna grab a hammer and my pry bar. <laughs> Little trailer brakes, we've got to get them off of there. <laughs> that is that red fuzzy stuff I was talking about. I don't know if y'all can see that. That's pretty, uh. Mm. I've never seen that like it. It's like felt Christmassy. Huh. I don't know what it is. Dual DVD multimedia receiver. DVD. I didn't know this thing had a TV on it. Surely not. It did. It's got a touch screen on it. Never knew it. Huh. Alright, I think that's going to be it for this week. You can see behind me the uh, great mess I've got going on. So, I'm going to get the rest of the dash pulled uh, so I get the wiring harness out so we can pass that through and then we start pulling the motor on it and be done with this portion. Um, a few parts we're going to save. I need to get the, uh, the, the AC blower stuff out of here also. Uh, so we're gonna put that in the load star as well. If, it, if I can make it fit, uh, that'll be tricky. Uh, the rest of the wiring, that kind of stuff. Let me come around here and show you uh, progress on the motor. So that's where we are on the motor. Again, we only got a few things left to get out of it. The uh, just a few more hookups here in the back and hookups on the other side, and then we're gonna push it back and get that dude out of there. So. Thanks for watching. We'll see you on the next video. Knock, knock. Who's there? Daisy. Rolling. Daisy who? They see me rolling. They hate it. I can't see nothing.